Ah, yes, the VGS-1. The fastest, most super complex supercomputer ever to be built. Yes, let's go power on. A world of computing delight awaits you. Greatest user, undefined user, welcome to your home computing experience. What is this, 1985 or 1995? I don't know. Open application, internet. Open application? Surf the net. You have selected the web surf application. Unfortunately, the tide is low right now. Please check it again later. Closing web search application. Fun. Games. You have selected the text based entertainment application. Open application. Yes, I will choose a game for my immeasurable library of purely non visual fun. I have selected Corgi Quest 7 The Leeches That Bind. You are Corgi. Your name is Alan. You must sever the magical leeching holding you to this plane of nastiness. Exit on north, east, and south. Go north. You go north. There is a the tiger. Exits. Ah. Uh. Talk, tiger. Your attempts do not sway the tiger. The, the conflict he has seen at the paws of your kind has given him strength such that the weight of your words are negligible. He mauls you very badly. Try again. Yes. It's very loud and good. The, ti the tiger is unduly startled and moves you. Oh, come on! Well, tiger with your claws is not much for your skill. Tigers and them will continue to be very endangered. All your crimes. You know where your quest began. You cannot actually go eat. You have been tricked. South, there is a south gate south. They are guarded by a prismatic wall. Thanks. And look, there is a set of big gates. They are guarded by an impatient looking prismatic wall. Bark again. You bark is being quite so rotten. So, so run as the prismatic wall rapidly shifts between spectrums between visible and invisible. You're a dog, so you really only see two colors in regardless. So whatever I guess it flees and the gates are now unguarded, it would probably come back if you left that. Oh. No. Go through the gates and arrive at a grassy clearing. There is a lot canyon here. Jump. Try to jump the canyon, it's possible you didn't know how big canyons are. And maybe that wasn't appropriately described. It was very large and measurably deep. Should you process the immense beast to do so? Look. There is a slight dry glassy clear and a large sweeping canyon separates it from another glassy clear to the west. There's a character in that clearing. Their name is Seven Conclusions. Jump to Conclusions! <laughs> you pass a small field and arrive at the camp of a wandering blacksmith in a larger field. He introduces himself as Barry. Exits are just about heavy direct. I guess it's a field. You talked about it. I may have mentioned this earlier, but it is a stretch to describe the noises you, <laughs> you make us talk. And the yeah, obvious making a weapon, it probably does so, it's a sword, for dogs. A dog sword, Oh, Smaller field behind you. A larger one encircling you in what I glean in a non friendly manner. There's a camp here and I checked so I can say with confidence. You think his tent is grey, Barry is here, also exit are literally everywhere in every sense so you can only go north. Oh. Yeah, go for jump to the conclusion. You attempt to jump to conclusions, but then make a hasty judgment without considering the facts. 
You plummet into the canyon for several seconds before seven levitates you out on that side. Seven is a wizard. You were on the other side of the canyon. Seven conclusions here. Dressed very badly as wizards so often are. There is a wizard tower. How long does this text this How long does this go on for? Wizard's tower to the south, but it doesn't belong to the There? There's we both looking correct in capital letters. Is on the plane of yellow exits or south. You could go east, but that would swiftly followed by down. Talk seven. You make dog noises at seven. They understand completely. The nearby wizard's tower would look very likely. Would very likely hold a way to remove that leaf. They say there's not much else around here. They continue. It's pretty sparse out here. Arrive at the tower. A ward's protecting it, and the boy. Boy, are they doing that in a passable manner? Seven is here as they followed you. There isn't much going on. They say exit or no. The dark noise in a way that suggests Seven should dispel the magical walls when they do it. And the you enter the tower. Very well lit, but that just makes it more obvious that the furniture is less a hand-picked furnishing and more a collection of needed objects that someone came to own as they became necessary. You know what I mean? They kind of match the effort was made to pick similar during darkness. Well, darkness words and the styles aren't completely dissimilar. Yeah, I'm just sliding taking some stuff that I don't need. What? See? Aside from Arsenal beating Wolves. Ha 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 ha. needs help from the wear and tear some of being used in longer. But. Longer though. And the brackets holding the longest shell on the wall of brass. Or brass. Whereas most of the other metal trimming and pieces are iron. Seven has been knocked unconscious by Bugbear while you looked at the furniture. Exit and all available given that you're in like a fight. Yeah, let's use a sword. Build your sword. Dogs in the manner to which you are accustomed. Which actually you know how dogs use swords right. I don't need to describe it. You slayed the Bugbear. Stars. Which do not match any of the woodwork are unguarded. Seven is on the floor but they're probably fine. Go up the stairs, all the way to the top of the tower. There's an altar and a magic, but exits are down and varying speeds depending on if you go in the different direction first. Go, Dennis. You focus your inner spirit and take in the minute magical energies of the book and the altar before speaking the word power. Power. You feel tangible reality slip away. In an instant, you'll push Dennis' way. Drive in. Thank you for playing this special demo of Kogi Quest 7. Oh, cop! I get nothing for that? Nothing. I didn't see an achievement at all. Well, I just wasted yours. Well, I wasted my time, essentially. <laughs> 